Team Keep It Clean. What's going on? It's Engraven here with another video. And just to be real with y'all, man, I'm hurting right now, man. I'm really hurting right now with just all the side stuff that's going on, man. Um, and I, I know some people be like, oh, well, why, why are you making a video then? You to take a break. I, trust me, I have been taking breaks, but man, it's, it's tough, man. It's really tough, man. And it's just, it's just messed up stuff going on, man. And, uh, but I, I, I feel like y'all are family, so I, I, I could share some with y'all, but, well, just share it with y'all how I'm feeling, man. Um, but it's tough, man. It's tough. It's really tough, man. But, um, again, like I, I said before, this, this actually, this helps me. Uh, the, the still continue to do videos and stuff. It helps me, uh, cause it kind of sort of takes my mind off of it a little bit, but sort of just again gives me a little outlet. And of course, I got outlets for family and friends and stuff like that. But this just serves as a another outlet, man. Um, but I I really do appreciate y'all, man. Stuff is uh stuff is just crazy, man. It's crazy. But anyway, um. I remember back when uh, the Ravens first brought in Willie Taggart. Uh, they brought him in for a visit. Uh, and the timing of it really made it look like it was, uh, it was was he was going to be the Ravens' next offensive coordinator. Uh, and the reason that was was because Greg Roman had recently interviewed to be a head coach at Stanford. Uh, and then we heard all these reports and stuff that Greg Roman was actually the favorite to, to land the job at Stanford. Uh, and that obviously it didn't end up happening. Um, so Greg Roman remained the offensive coordinator for the Baltimore Ravens. Uh, and we didn't we didn't hear anything about Willie Taggart at all after that. Uh, but now uh, it's official that the Ravens are bringing him on. They putting him on the staff. I know Munkin yesterday in his presser, he talked about how um, they weren't done because he was asked about the, the, the staff and he said that they weren't done. They still got some stuff to finalize and whatnot. And basically what he was saying was that, yeah, there's going to be some people that's brought on him. There's possibly going to be some people that's taken off as well. So we'll see how that goes. But let's just read the report straight from Tom Pellicero. He says the Ravens are expected to hire Willie Taggart as their running backs coach. Uh, per source Taggart the former head coach at FAU uh, Florida State Oregon South Florida and Western Kentucky uh, was once Jim Harbaugh's running back coach at Stanford now joins brother John in Baltimore so of course we know um about the family ties and whatnot uh John Harbaugh he spoke yesterday saying that it was his sister his sister's husband uh that put them on to Todd Munkin uh and then of course with Willie Taggart uh he's somebody that's well respected um by the whole Harbaugh family um I know he had ties with their dad with John and Jim's dad um and like Tom Pellicero mentioned in his report uh he was once Jim Harbaugh's running back coach at Stanford um so Everything usually all ties in together, and, and we know like when it comes to. I know we we talk about it a lot with with John Harbaugh. We call him hashtag Hood Harbaugh because he always putting his people on, which is a nice thing, and that happens uh, a lot. Obviously, we focus on the Ravens, so we we talk about it happening with them a lot. But it, it, it's just one of them things that just it happens with a lot of coaches. They they put on people that they know, that they're familiar with, that they trust, that they got love for, and they give them opportunities. Um, so that's it is what it is. So yeah, Ravens with a new running back coach. Um, and again, the staff is is still is the the coaching staff is still continuing uh, to be shaped. So we'll see that how that goes. Team, keep it clean. I really do love y'all. I appreciate y'all, and we out.